Well, congratulations on the win, AJ. You got your first home run at UCF. How did that feel? Um, it felt awesome to, you know, get that one out of the way. Um, been waiting for it for a little while now, but um, you know, it was good to take a team AB and get one to get out of here. So. Did you know as soon as you? Um, it was a tough wind all the way through BP, so did not know it off the bat, but um, you know, they got out of here and it was a good feeling. What's it been like for this team now? You know, you had those offensive str uh, struggles coming off that first Central Michigan game, and now you score double digit runs in every game since. Um, you know, obviously it gives us a little bit more uh, motivation and it gives us more confidence, but um, you know, we've known our identity as an offense, you know, going throughout this season, you know, um, quality at bats one after the other, and then um, eventually somebody's going to get the big swing off, but um, you know, um, it's really good with momentum as we move into uh, face another good team this weekend. So, has it been a good stretch of games for you? You're coming on, you're hitting better. Like, how how you been feeling out there lately? Um, I feel like I'm seeing it a lot better. Um, you know, I've been trying to do anything I can to uh, get on base, help the team win, and um, you know, when that's my mindset, I feel like uh, um, I do a better job up there. So, you feel your confidence just increasing? Oh yeah. Um, each game, you know, you start seeing a little bit better and, um, you know, you just always have that confidence in yourself, but obviously when things are going well, you, um, have the confidence is a tick up. You mentioned quality at bats one after the other. How do you feel about your role in that being the leadoff hitter? Um, I feel like it's my job, you know, to let the guys see some pitches, um, you know, let them see what, uh, our opponent has given us and then, um, you know, find any way on base. And when I do get on base, you know, um, try to take an extra base, do things to get into scoring position so that I can let the uh, big guys behind me work, so. AJ, hey what's it been like just being part of this team? I know you're from the Tampa area, from Florida. You guys are playing well, you're in the mix. You're trying to get to a regional now. We're hitting almost May before you know it. What's it like being on, the, on this team this season? It's great. I mean, the chemistry, you know, I could talk about that more than our level of play on the field, you know. We, I feel like we've all come together and molded and, um, you know, we all want to see each other succeed. And, you know, even guys who aren't in the game, you know, it's, um, you know, how can we win? How can we help the team? Things like that. But I think uh, the chemistry is very noteworthy of this team. Back to conference play this week. And where do you think this team is right now? Um, I feel like this is a team that doesn't quit. I feel like any time that you roll into the John, it's going to be a tough game for you. And, um, you know, I feel like we're a tough team to play as long as we stick to uh, what the coaches are telling us and we execute. What has the team learned from this past week that they're, go that they're going to take you, you, or that you want them to take with them into this last stretch of conference play? Uh, there's going to be a lot of highs and lows. Obviously, you go to West Virginia and it's not the uh, outcome you wanted, but you were right in there in every single game, and then you come back this weekend, you fall short Friday night, but then you bounce back Saturday and Sunday, and that goes back to the, uh, you know, us not quitting and sticking to our identity and things like that. Good stuff. Awesome. Appreciate it. Thanks a lot, AJ. Yeah. Thank you. Thank Good you luck guys. to you, man.